It's another busy day in Ilori, the Kwa State capital, north central Nigeria. Once again, commuters wait anxiously, oftentimes endlessly, for buses or taxis to get to their destinations. And with the increase in population, the resources to commute seem grossly inadequate. But all this is about to change with the purchase of buses to ply various routes in the state capital. It's the first phase of the Kwara State Transport Scheme to reduce the frustrations faced by commuters. <laughs> Governor Abdul Fattah Ahmed cuts the tape, signaling the commencement of a scheme that will support the existing transportation system and make it easier for comers to thrive. This scheme upscales the existing transport scheme, which involves motorcycles, taxis, and many buses by introducing higher capacity mass transit buses. With this scheme, intra and intercity transportation will now be more available, affordable, and efficient. As the name implies, Megida Solidar or Mass Transit Scheme is designed to ease the hardship faced by the populace, especially students workers and other commuters who are often stranded for hours, particularly during peak hours. The buses were bought by the state government for use by members of the National Union of Road Transport Workers at a cost of 267 million naira. We appreciate your excellency and we assure you we'll cooperate and use this vehicle judiciously. Other transport unions hope the second phase will be more inclusive. We want to urge you to consider road transport employers of Nigeria during the second phase of the project. We are part of this government and therefore we are partners in progress. In the coming months, the government has promised that more money will be pumped into the transportation system to put more buses on other routes within and outside the state capital.